Well, that was nice to finally sleep in a normal bed. We better get going. Garrett's already rolling. Morning, morning, morning. You heading out? I'll be right behind you. Yes, sir. Start up the other truck. We got to go check on our tomatoes. Our water trailer's empty. Better fill her up. Oh, geez. Look, the trees have grown. Oh, my goodness. You're right. And one fell over. What the heck? Oh, uh, did it grow first? Nope. Okay. Yeah, it was one of the baby ones. I was going the wrong side of the watering well. You'll figure it out eventually. And there goes all of our money. Nice. It looks like the tomatoes have been producing. Look at all those pallets. Oh, yeah. And we even have some potatoes, I guess, from before we didn't collect them all. Let's get these things loaded up. It looks like we have almost four full pallets of tomatoes. One more squeeze on there. And, oh, that's actually pretty full. You said a little bit of tomatoes. This is a bunch. Well, that last one's potatoes, but yeah. <laughs> Sorry, tomatoes, potatoes, who, you know, they all sound the same. Now, are we going to keep this on tomatoes? Yes, uh, unless we want to switch it. Throw me some options. Okay, we could do lettuce, uh, sunflowers. That sounds lame. Sunflowers uh, maybe lettuce. look cool. Yeah, we can do lettuce. That's fine. Yeah. Okay, there's also strawberries. That would be, I guess, the... Let's do strawberries. Deer that sounds good. Okay, strawberries it is. Well, Garrett was talking about money earlier, and we actually, we know we have some money in the bank. I'm curious what's at the dealership. Let's see. Those two look familiar. These are new. 1900 bucks for this little, what even is it? A bucket? Oh, it's a three-point deal. Okay, you can put it on the tractor, or you can put it on my truck, too. I got a three-point in the front. And 3500 bucks for this little wagon. This is sweet. Slow moving vehicle sign. Check it out. They got some new stuff here. No, the, what's gone? The golf cart. Where did that go? That's right. Yeah, they must have replaced it out and they actually had another slot. But the oh, six geez. by six side by side still there and Tesla. Okay, well, I really hope we can get one of those at some for $20,000 for I the know, side I know. We got to figure out how to make some more money. But uh, this would be kind of nice to have around on the tractor, haul some more material. Yeah, do you want to buy it now or do you want to first sell the stuff so... We aren't going to go completely broke. Let's buy it now. It's no different. Okay. And then, yeah, maybe we could even get this trailer hopefully later today. Yeah, I think that would be sweet. What if we had that trailer hooked up on the back of this tractor, the three-point in the front, and then this thing is essentially another one of our trucks because we're always hauling material. That'd be great. Okay. That all sounds good to me. Let's buy the three-point. There she is. Got her sold. We're under a thousand bucks now. Here, help me push this out of here. Yeah, just drag it on the ground and get that three. Oh, come on. It's hung okay. up. There we go. How are we looking? You're good. All right. I know Garrett isn't going to like this, and our bank account's going to go even lower, but I'm going to fill the trailer up again with water. It's not going to... Yeah, we're about 500 Hey, Spencer. Bucks. Sorry. What the heck? Well, let's see what we can get from these. Hopefully at least 300 to pay our expenses. Oh, jeez. It's flying. We're about to hit 1,000. Here we go. Keep going up. Keep going up. Yeah, we need to get much further than that. Oh, yeah. It's actually, that's going to get us there nicely. There we are. Almost 2400 bucks. How much was that trailer? Uh, it was 3500 I want to say. Yeah, so we're still a bit of ways from that. I guess that means we got to make more money. How do you want to go about that? Do you want to dig some material? Let's go get some... We'll just get some stone real quick. Do a quick load. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. You need something um, in the back. Yeah, what, what makes you think that? Is it the fact that my back wheels are currently floating? Is that full? That is full, yep. Are we sure this was the right vehicle to grab? Uh, we just need something in the back. Hang on. Wait, can't I just put this at the back? Why do I have to have this on the front? That's a good point. Yeah, you should be good. Have you popped a wheelie on? Oh, no, he's popping uh -oh. a wheelie too. Come on. Is, is this is this the method? Yep, that's going to work well. There you go. All right. Now, you, you got to get creative here. You got to figure some stuff. There you go. I can barely even drive straight. I know. Just nice and easy. Get over there, sell it, and we'll figure it out later. You're getting it sold? Looks a little rough. Uh, I got some of it sold. We may have to shift that stuff around in order for it to sell. Bring this good load over while I'm unloading. Detach from that. I'll hook up to it. Okay. There we go. I'm unloading just fine over here. We'll figure that thing out. I'm not too worried about it. Hey, don't forget to fill your bucket if you're going to head over there. Oh, that's true. Okay. All right. This should be able to fill up the back. If my math is correct. Yep. And then go to the okay. front. Oh, yeah. It's weighing you. That's fun to watch. <laughs> yeah, it is. Oh, geez. 6,000 liters of material. I'm driving just fine. I mean, I noticed the weight, and when I hit the brakes, it takes a little longer, but not too bad. Uh, you could probably sell a little bit more than that. That was $14 worth. I know. It's being a little finicky. Well, just keep selling little bits at a time. Okay, let's unload the bed first. I'm curious. When that thing's full, there's no weight in the back, what it looks like. 
Oh, geez. It definitely is lifting you up. Uh-oh. Oh, oh yeah. Uh -oh. Check that out. All right. Just hang back there. Let me see here. This should unload. It's been a little weird. Maybe we'll just use our front to move stuff around. You know, yeah. it does have a strap for that bucket, so I guess, like, oil barrels would fit in there. And Are look empty? at that. 3600 bucks. We can go buy that trailer, dude. Spencer, that would leave us with 10 or Sorry, not $10. It would leave us with $100. Yeah, I know. Oh, can I go faster than you know? No. No, not at all. I thought for a second there. I don't know. I felt like I was gaining ground. Oh, geez. Yeah. Okay, I'll be in your dust. Are you sure we want to buy this? I think so. Why not? It would be perfect to keep moving our business forward. I know. It's just so expensive. I, I guess probably within the day it will pay itself off. So. Yes. It's going to haul material, and that's what we're doing the most right now. 3500 bucks. Let's get her bought. Well, congratulations. We got 100 bucks in the bank. Yeah, don't remind me. Let's get this thing connected. I need money coming into the account as soon as possible. There you go. Should be good. Oh, it is high off the ground. That's quite the look. What are we doing next? I'd say let's go fill up with some iron so we can make some barrels. 10-4, yep, that's a right. For a second, I thought it was a left. Now, the toughest part about little trailers like this is backing them up because the second they get out of alignment, they go quick. Backing up's a little sketchy. All right, moment of truth. Fill the trailer first? Oh, yeah, I want to see how much it can hold and, you know... If the truck can even handle this much weight on the back. I'm worried about the angle of the trailer. Yeah, I am too a little bit. Raise up, man. I can just tilt the bucket. It filled up pretty quick there, not gonna lie. Oh, yeah, that's all it holds. So, one full bucket and then, uh, like, 25% of another. Let's unload the trailer. As that's coming down, we're already getting ready for the next one. You know what? Now that I think about it, I should have done our little three-point guy first. There we go. Now it unloads all at once. Now let's get some barrels made. Heck yeah. Well, that's a lot of barrels right there, brother. Oh, yeah. I hope we're going to be able to fill all these. I guess we could also fill up my trailer. I did drive down here. Last one coming in. Thank you. There we go. We got the three unloaded automatic. That's nice. Let's load them up. They sure are pretty heavy. Wait, do we even have straps in this trailer? It's all right. It's so heavy, ain't it? it it's not going to go anywhere. Now, Spencer, do you remember where to bring these two? Uh, I'll let you go first. Not really. It's right over here. There are mine in there. Should just auto go in once you drive through. Am I not Hopefully. close enough? Uh, back up. Okay. Uh, yeah, we're going to have to manually unload these. Last one getting unloaded. There we are. Sweet. All right. This place should start turning that into diesel. Yeah, crude oil just under 4,000 liters. And then what do you do? Flip a switch and the baby runs? I have no clue what happens on the internals of this thing. But yeah, just flip a switch and it's pretty much magical. Looks like it's running, converting the oil into diesel. That looks good. Yeah, we're going to have 875 liters. Not bad at all. Since we got 100 bucks in the bank, we I can't be done working for the day without getting that baby up. Let's go cut some wood and we can always come back and see how much that tank fills up. Let's do it. Yeah, these things are huge. They grew even more. Yeah, I was just about to say, I can't believe how tall they got. Besides for that one that fell over from the wind. No, no, Spencer, don't do what? it. Don't. It's got a little rack. Metal rack. Oh. Give me a chance. Here we go. I think we're going to do one tree at a time. These are going to be a lot to handle. It's going to take a while to chop her down with the old Where axe. are you dropping it? Which direction? I don't know. Don't move the tractor. Timber. Yeah, back it up a little. Okay, there we go. Probably don't need to chop all these trees down. All right, I'm all rolling right. out. Sounds good. Let's head down to... Oh, geez. I don't sawmill. even need... Um, okay. Yeah. Oh, no. Don't do that. All right. Let's head down there. You think... How much money? Throw your guesses in. It must be like at least... I don't know. Like a thousand? I'm Is that thinking, too much? Yeah. I'm thinking like two thousand. Two thousand. Okay. Watch out for the sawdust pile. I think that actually belongs to us. We could probably sell that someday. That would be sweet. We're at a hundred bucks right now. Let's move these over. I'll get out of your way. Hey. They should be unstrapped. Oh, you know what? I got it. I got it. I got it. Is it the front? It is. There you go. Oh, yeah. I was confused. I was like, I, I know I'm not the strongest guy out there, but I feel weak right now. If this makes us like 2,000 bucks, that's going to be crazy. That just means, you know, we plant a couple more trees, wait a month or two, and should be able to buy a vehicle. You ready to see? I am. We're at 101 right now. Let's do this. 3,200 buckaroos. Dude, we got like 15 grand at home. 20. That is not bad at all. We're going to yeah. definitely process more of those trees. Let's, I guess, plant to finish the day. Yes, sir. How does it feel to be the only one working right now, huh? 
tables have turned. I'm not complaining. Oh, just give it some time. Well, thanks for watching, guys. Next episode, I think we're going to make quite a bit of money. I'll see you in the next one. Hee <laughs> hee.